finally being able to take the wraps off Microsoft Mesh and being able to give a tour to you all. Before we get started, let me give you a quick tour of the setup. What you are seeing is a custom camera rig that gives you the perspective as if you are wearing a HoloLens. With that, let me flip my HoloLens visor down and uh, enter Microsoft Mesh. Foundational to Microsoft Mesh is this notion of spaces. Think of spaces like a conference room, except something that is persisted across time and geographies. I have my home space. I have a pipeline review space where my colleagues are waiting for. So let me go ahead and enter the pipeline review space. And I can see here my dear friend Nishant waiting in the review space. So Nishant, great to see you here. Hey, Simon. How are you doing? Hello. Uh, hey, Nishant, can you explain a little bit of what you are seeing? Absolutely, Simon. I see an avatar of yours and I hear your voice as if you were right across the room from me here. I see an awesome hologram of a table which is inviting me to bring in 3D models and create and collaborate upon it. And of course, as I lift my hands, I see the hand menu where I can bring in more people into the space. I can go ahead and change my avatar and appearance. I can annotate, draw, and bring in more shapes and figures into the space, as well as bring in 2D and 3D content to collaborate upon. Hey, Nishant, since we are here to take a look at the project that Doreen worked on, do you think you could quickly invite her if she's available to the space? Certainly, Simon. Let me invite Doreen. While Nishant is doing this, I want to make a mention that Microsoft Mesh is integrated with AAD and MSA so that hosts can invite participants into designated spaces in a simple but trustworthy manner. When I lower down my visor, I can see that Nishant has already invited Doreen to this space. Hey Doreen, great to see you here. Hi Simon, hi Nishant. Doreen, so great to see you. Do you recall the pipeline project that you worked on? It needs a quick review. If you could kindly bring in that model from your OneDrive so we all could take a look at it and make a few recommendations to the engineers, that'd be great. Absolutely. Let me pull it up from my OneDrive. What's great about Mesh is the integration with the Microsoft 365 graph. What we show here is actually a model that our customers use today. This is a part that is used to prevent spills. But the idea is that a wide range of data can be showed inside of Mesh your connections, your collaborative efforts, your workflows, even your documents transfer very well from a 2D space into a 3D space. So one of the things about collaboration in mixed reality is the three-dimensional fidelity that it offers. And while each of us can have a unique perspective into it, we all can rotate, translate, pan, zoom, add or redact from this model, driving clarity to the decision-making while reducing the cost and complexity of being in in-person meetings. One of the things that I miss out really in in-person meeting is the ability for us to annotate in a whiteboard or on a, on a paper. And with Microsoft Mesh-enabled applications, I can bring up my hand menu, bring up my annotations here, and my fingers turn into, at this time, essentially a pen through which I can annotate in a space. I can see here that uh, while I've been doing this, my colleagues here have annotated as well. Yeah, and speaking of annotations, I think there's a piece of this model we should look at. Can you come over here and take a look quickly? Sure. Great, I'm actually noticing that this space on the model here uh, may actually need a further look from our engineering team. It seems like there might be something out of date. Do you think we can take a look with them maybe early next week? Yeah, I can request the engineering team to come and take a look. One of the benefits of collaboration in, in Microsoft Mesh is the ability for us to persist these spaces across time and geographies. So the engineering team can come, join the space, and pick up precisely where we left off with the annotations, with the 3D models, with the point of view that Doreen wanted us to take a look at it. 
And at any point in time, if they need the help of Doreen or Nishad for an expert eyes or hands, they just know that they are just a mesh tap away. Uh, so thank you, Doreen and uh, Nishan joining on a short notice. We look forward to working together with you again on another project sometime soon. With that, I've given you a quick tour of Microsoft Mesh experience for HoloLens.